hey everybody welcome back to my channel so as you can see I have a small 99 cent store haul as well as a few things very small haul from Dollar Tree but of course I always like to share with you guys the items that I picked up so I'm going to start with one of the reusable bags um, you guys know Dollar Tree and 99 cent store they always get the cutest reusable bags you guys know I call my baby Pooh Bear, so when I saw this, I definitely had to get this. Plus, the movie is either out or it's about to be out, and we are planning on going to see that. So, um, when I fill up our little snack bag to sneak in the movie theater, it will go in here. <laughs> and it's so cute. It has a little seal right here that says 100 Acre Wood and the poo at the top so I definitely had to pick that up now my purpose in going to the 99 cent store was to get some tissue they do have these um, 12 rolls double rolls for only $2.99 and this is my favorite type of toilet paper and the reason why I needed to go there to get them and I got multiple packs of these especially for three dollars is because I don't know if you guys are aware but every time I go in Target now and also Walmart they have stopped selling the smaller rolls like this unless it's like a generic brand they have made all of their toilet paper like mega or triple or whatever you want to call it but i know mega is one of the words so the really really big um rolls of tissue and i hate those rolls uh because i just do uh when you put it on a the thing in the bathroom if it's wedged between like the wall the tissue won't roll so I don't like those really big rolls so I definitely stocked up on a bunch of Cottonelle from the 99 cent store because three dollars for 12 rolls of that brand is amazing so I had to go pick that up then I saw this and I just decided to get this to keep in my car in the glove compartment it's just a little first aid kit and I thought it was cute. It comes in its own little snap container or whatever. And it has a bunch of stuff in there. So I picked that up to keep. Then I saw these soaps. And there was another one. There was one in the container. And me and another lady was going through them. And she happened to get it. So I was only able to get three. There's four different ones. So the first one is this um, orange. And it looks like that. And it's on a rope. Really cute. And it looks like a real orange right here and in the back is smooth so I just thought these were super cute that one this one is supposed to be pineapple and it looks like that and it I can't really smell it through the package but what little bit that I can smell they smell really really good and then this one is mango of course isn't that cute just soap on a rope I just thought these were cute uh, that looks like that now the the coconut one which I really wanted was half it looks like a coconut that was cut in half so it was black on the outside and then it was like a bowl and the inside was white just like a coconut unfortunately there was only one and the, la the lady that was standing there with me she got it so <laughs> I couldn't get that one and then I saw the mainstay uh, odor neutralizing room spray in raspberry parfait and this is a brand that sold at Walmart and I sprayed a little bit in the cap in the store and it smelled pretty good so I just went ahead and got one of these and I thought that was cool because this is like a Walmart brand I believe I know they sell it at Walmart but I don't know if it's just solely supposed to be a Walmart brand I did get some cookies by Welch's sugar cookie bites real fruit raspberry i hope these are good i really hope these are good i have high hopes for those they also had a peanut butter i can't remember the peanut butter and grape i think i took some pictures i'll show you guys but they have another pack of those um what else did i get i'm saving the best for last you guys there was like a happy planner dupe i'm gonna show you in a minute uh oh then i got these uh two uh wristlet type coin bags or whatever and I just thought these were super cute this one says hashtag follow, hashtag follow me and it's like in a rose gold with glitter super cute the back is plain and then adulting is overrated I just thought these were super cute so I picked up both of those uh what else okay um we're almost to the good the good thing that I wanted to share with you guys 
whenever I see these, which they pop up every now and then, I love to get these. Uh, this one is an exfoliating body scrubber. And I just like these. The last one that I got had a little hand. It looks, oh, this one does too. You can see it through here. It has a little handle that you put your hand through and then you can kind of scrub your body with it. So I like those. Uh, this one is also a stretch cloth and it's good to do your back. You just hold both ends and kind of scrub your back like her. Really, really nice. And then this one is a dual texture face and body scrubber. And I got this one for my daughter so she can do her face with it. So I just got those three. Uh, what else? Then I saw these candles and they're by Huntington Home. They were $2.99. Um... I never saw these in a 99 cent store and I definitely wanted to try them. I am going to burn these today. I'll show you the three that I picked. I'm going to burn them or at least burn one of them. And if they're if the strong if the scent is uh strong, then I'll definitely be going back before they're sold out. They have four fragrances. I picked up three out of the four. So this one is Georgia Peach. It is a three wick and that's why I'm like, "Oh my goodness, I hope these smell really good because that price uh, for a three week and um, not really having to go through my Bath and Body Works candles <laughs> would be great. So Georgia Peach. Here is Watermelon Lemonade. I'm super excited. I think I'm going to burn this one. I think I'm going to try that one first. Because watermelon candles tend to have like a very light scent. So I'll know if that one has a good throw or not. And then Coconut Beach. This one smells really good in the jar too. The other one that they had was more of a floral scent. And I've always spoke about it. I cannot stand floral scents. I uh, just don't like it. So I don't pick those up. Okay. And last but not least from the 99 cent store. They had this kit. In the past they had another uh, planner kit. And it was super cute. Uh, it was like mermaids and all this other stuff. But when I saw this one, the way these discs look on here, to me, it reminded me of the Happy Planner. So I had to get this to look at it. This is the Happy Planner. And, you know, the Happy Planner has the little hearts in there. Can you see that? Well, I'm sure you're familiar. Most of you guys are familiar with the disc, the hearts. But this is why I got it. It reminded me of the Happy Planner. And then it comes with, it says, 95 pages to color. Um, 60 undated. So it is an undated planner, which is great. Um, a gel pen that's included. Three rolls of washi tape. And 477 stickers for $5. So I definitely wanted to get this. To share it with you guys, I have not opened this. To op uh, to share with you guys to see if it's any good. That way, if it is, you guys can go get one if you have a 99 cent store in your area. Okay, so let's look at this planner. And if I don't use it, I'll give it to my daughter. So first off, it's cool. Let me cut this open. So far, I think it's cool. The discs don't have the holes in there, so... Uh. But it's really cute. Um, the front is a little flimsy. Hold on, you guys. My leg is falling asleep. <laughs> okay, so the front to me is a little flimsy, but it's still cute. Oh, look. It looks kind of just like it. Art of planning. This planner belongs to. And then let's see. Oh, I think this is cute. Oh, my goodness. This looks just like it. Look at that. The whole layout and everything. Okay. 99 cent store look at you and then so you even have this month with the reading the notes birthdays goals and then i guess this is what they mean you can color it so that's that you have to put your dates in there let's see and then it looks the same all the way through and so for each tab you have you get another picture to color <clears throat> oh this is nice This is really nice, actually, for, for just for $5. This is super cute. Okay, let me see. Pages get a little stuck, um, probably because they haven't been turned. There you go. So you do have to finagle it a little bit, but it probably will get looser as you go. And it's the same because you can still pop. Let me see. Yep, you can still pop the pages off just like a Happy Planner. How cute is that? So 
that is the actual planner the cover is not that cute I mean be true to you that's the cute saying but I'm not big on those that color scheme not at all okay so then it comes with this and it looks black and then here's some washi tape three small rows this one looks floral and this one is just like spots or whatever and then stripes so that's cute and the last thing in here is a bunch of planner stickers let's see if they are they look like they're different let's see fill your day these are cute these are cute oh yeah they're all different so then you have those oh you got some dates right there or yeah the numbers that is so cool and then they give you the months and that so that's cute five dollars five dollars that's not bad that's definitely not bad if you have a teenager or if you're just starting out wanting to plan and you know you don't want to you know jump into a happy planner or any of the other ones this would definitely be a good beginner or starter um planner for people that are like i've heard there's people that give classes that teach people how to plan and stuff this would be a cute little uh, starter planner for stuff like that or whatever so I'm very happy with that that's cute if I don't deal with it or if I don't use it of course I'll just pass it on to my daughter um, sometimes if she doesn't want something we usually just give stuff to one of her friends or whatever so let me move this to the side and then I'll jump into the few things that I got from the Dollar Tree okay so now let's get into this Dollar Tree stuff like I said you guys it was not a lot at all I did pick up some uh, pure silk twin blade uh, five you get five razors and you know it's the twin blade I just keep these as a backup just in case I run out I prefer to use like the four or five uh, blade razor but yeah so I got those as a backup then I saw some cute little coasters that had all these different sayings on them. I did take pictures. Uh, but I picked the one that says, Do all things with love. I usually keep a cup of water or something next to my bed, like on my nightstand. And uh, sometimes the water, you know, if it's cold, real cold, the water will drip down onto the dresser. And I hate that. So I just got this to go next to my bed. And uh, I just thought that was a cute saying. And it says a naturally absorbent coasters. They've always had these, but this is just like a new design. I see it like a, a rose or something on there. I just thought these were cute. So I got that. They had these Yes to Cotton Mask. And in the last haul, I showed the Blueberry products. Um, so I just went ahead and picked up these two. You guys, I do not like to use masks too often not often at all but I am willing to try this uh I just I don't know I just picked up two of them I'll probably give one to my sister or something like that but I'm gonna try one and then as much as I try my hardest not to look at the seasonal stuff oh my goodness I went ahead and picked up this just because I thought it was cute and I know it's gonna go kind of fast this one that says hello fall with the pumpkin it's just a little wood sign so I thought that was really cute and then I did go ahead and get this banner that says thankful and blessed and you can hang that somewhere and I just thought that was super cute and then the last thing I got from Dollar Tree was I did pick up this body soap by Daily Defense and it's nourishing mango tango with pro vitamin B5 and it is a body wash and it smelled kind of good in the container so I just wanted to give that a try because I've never seen the mango tango so that is it for my Dollar Tree. I told you guys there that was small. I mainly was going to the 99 cent store to get some tissue and ended up with all of this stuff. <laughs> so thank you guys all for watching. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button. I'd love for you to stick around. And for everybody else, thank you. Thank you for supporting my channel and always coming back. I appreciate every last one of you. I hope you're having a beautiful day and I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye.